Every day, technology gets us a little closer to unraveling the mysteries around us. A perfect example of this is the satellite-based program known as Google Earth, which allows anyone to get a view of anywhere on Earth. Well, almost anywhere. It turns out there are a lot of strange sightings and mysteries on the app, from censored regions to crop circles that could be further evidence to the existence of aliens. Here are the top 15 strangest mysteries and sightings on Google Earth. Number 15. Snow Saddle Let's get a jump start with the mysterious on this one. Countless people all over the world have lost trust in their government, believing in corruption and the cover-up of an abundance of conspiracies. Many of those conspiracies happen to do with, you guessed it, aliens or UFOs. Basically, anything outworldly can be easily covered with the right government power and this alleged UFO entrance in the Nepal Himalayas may lend evidence to that ideal. This censored area is located at the Kang Tega Peak, or Snow Saddle, which is a towering summit in the Nepal Himalayas, which reaches a height of over 22,000 feet. This specific area, as well as two nearby locations, are known in the UFO community as hotspots or active regions. Normal people, hikers, and alien junkies alike have reported strange sightings and occurrences in this area, which really makes one wonder why censor this. Google Earth usually censors areas that could be controversial, that they have been contacted to censor, or that hide something the public should not see. For this blacked out spot, we are left to wonder why Google has chosen to cover it up. Could the government have contacted them to cover the location, or face consequences? Perhaps there's a crashed UFO here, or it's an entrance to a secret government base used for hiding spacecrafts and creatures. At least those are the speculations going around related to this region. Blogger Scott Waring notes that this area of the mountain is opposite of where climbers would ascend, and could be accessible most easily through aircraft. He also mentions that UFO enthusiasts should stop focusing on Area 51, because the government has already admitted to its existence and instead should focus on locations like these that are hidden from public eye. Before we go any further, what do you think? Is the government hiding alien or military bases from us? Give us your yes or no answer in the comments below. It's a proven fact that generosity makes you a happier person. So if you're generous enough to like this video, then thank you. Number 14. Atlantis The lost city, the forgotten empire. Atlantis has made its name in media as one of the most mystical and mysterious points for debate. Originating from Plato's creation, Many have argued whether the city was real and based on an actual historical event, or if Plato was simply using it as a great and false example in his commentary on politics. Scientists, historians, researchers, and of course, conspiracy theorists have dedicated their life's work to finding the lost city, and this Google Earth location may be another clue in the search. An underwater location just off the coast of Africa appears to be the layout of a city about the size of Wales. Though Google has slightly censored the region by pixelating details, thousands are convinced this is the lost city of Atlantis, laying on the ocean floor. Of course, Google released a statement that it was merely a digital glitch, but what kind of researchers would we be if we blindly believed what anyone told us? After all, isn't it possible that the government and certain corporations would benefit from hiding the empire? Number 13. The Guardian The Badlands Guardian, also known as the Indian Head, is a structure carved into the earth near Medicine Hat of Alberta, Canada. The head appears to be a human face, pointed westward and sporting a full First Nations headdress. In addition to these classic depictions, the head also appears to be wearing a pair of earbuds. However, that has been explained as a road leading to an oil well, which will be covered when the project is completed. This mystery has been debunked as a simple trick of erosion, coincidentally creating this facial structure. Regardless of what science says, there are plenty of skeptics out there that claim this could have been carefully carved by aboriginals from hundreds of years ago, or even more strange, it could have been carved in by an unearthly force for some reason. Regardless of what you believe created the Indian head, the site is marvelous and leaves the mind wondering of all of the possibilities from centuries ago. Even if you believe this was just a scientific miracle, the details are incredible and make even the most sound scientists wonder how something could be carved so delicately without the assistance of humans or even more powerful hands. Number 12. Secret Siberian City 
what looks like a glitch in a photo could actually be a huge government secret. This region of the map has been purposely blurred out, and many believe it must have something to do with Russian nuclear engineering. In the late 1980s, cities and open fields across Russia were sealed and hidden from the public. Special permission was required for entering these towns, and they are even kept from some maps. It was never confirmed what exactly was being done in these secret cities but evidence has suggested that towns were used for nuclear engineers to live, study, and test nuclear energy and weaponry to gain the upper hand against the US. These cities were given code names such as Tomsk 7 and as Rama 16. To this day, Russia has never released further information on these areas and the censored portion of the map makes many worry that nuclear testing is still going strong. It's not uncommon for heavily militarized countries to have secret cities much like these, but that won't stop the rest of the world from wondering what's going on within those borders. There are few that believe this could just be a radar station or missile site, but the internet investigators aren't giving up easily. In fact, through the work of those committed to this conspiracy, it was found out that this portion of the map was actually cut and pasted from somewhere in the country and then blurred over again. That's two extreme steps to cover something up. It's important to remember that if Google was contacted by a government official or sanctioned to cover this region, they would be legally required to make that cover up. So while Google is not the conspirator here, hiding important nuclear sites from us, it's likely that some division of Russian government went the extra mile to cover this location from nosy foreigners. Number 11. Ghost Ship when this point was first discovered on Google Earth, it alerted visitors and made room for concern and speculation. The wrecked and abandoned ship in Humbush Bay, near Sydney, Australia does have an eerie appearance. The ship is rusted old and covered in trees and moss. People began saying it was an abandoned warship that was left to cover dark secrets of the military. Well, that explanation is interesting and really makes you yearn for more. It's only partially true. The large ship was originally commissioned as a steam coiler and was later used to transport supplies to American troops during World War II. This ghostly ship, named the SS Airfield, was retired in 1972 and sent to Homebush Bay with several other ships to be taken apart, while most of them were eventually dismantled. The SS Airfield and four other massive ships remain in the bay. However, the SS Airfield is arguably the most beautiful of the group as nature has decorated it with a small forest of its own. So if you are looking for a dark government secret hidden in an Australian bay, this isn't it. But if you are looking for a hauntingly beautiful floating forest from the past, you've come to the right place. Number 10. Junction Ranch most believe that our government should not and would not hide things from us. It's a pretty simple concept that a government should be open with its constituents. Then again, we clearly don't live in a perfect world. Whether it's the US, Russia, Mexico, France, or any other country on this vast planet, it has become clear over centuries that our government isn't always honest or ethical. Because of this, many citizens have dedicated their time to trying to uncover some secrets the government may keep sealed away. America is perhaps the best example of this. From Area 51 to countless secret societies, the USA is filled with curious and concerned Americans looking for answers. In more recent years, this has been highlighted by Junction Ranch. The Mojave RCS facilities are about four different locations owned and operated by the US Navy in the western Mojave Desert region of California. While well, three of these locations are well known to the public, it's the fourth that sparks speculation, known as Junction Ranch. It's the only of the four locations with limited information available and higher security. While most information offered on the web explains that Junction Ranch is used for weaponry and radar testing, these recent images from Google Earth makes that questionable. These images clearly show two separate ranges on the map that have been blurred or drawn over. While it's easy to say that the US government has chosen to hide this due to other countries, countless Americans are still unsettled and concerned with the censorship. Some say that a great military should keep some secrets, but others believe that a government should provide unlimited answers to its citizens. Do you think that it's a simple military testing, or is there something more sinister being done here? Number 9. Pentagram in Central Asia near Kazakhstan, there's a strange and alarming symbol carved into the earth. A large pentagram measuring 1,200 feet in diameter seems to have been designed into the ground near an isolated lake. As many know, the pentagram is a star symbol with a circle surrounding it. The pentagram has origins in pagan culture but has also become associated with the occult and satanic worship. 
When this imagery was found on Google Earth, speculation ran wild with secret societies, satanic worshipping grounds and the Illuminati. To make the situation even more mysterious, when zooming in on Google Earth, two highlighted regions are visible to show that previous visitors have been to those spots. Those locations are named Adam and Lucifer. Archaeologist Emma Uzmanova explains that the pentagram is really just a park in the shape of a star. Stars were apparently very popular design styles during the Soviet era, and the circle surrounding the five-pointed star is the coincidence of a road that wraps around the park. Of course, this is a logical explanation, but that will never stop the conspiracy theorists and believers of evil out there. Images from inside the park just show an abandoned field-like area. If this was a great empire for Satan, it was certainly too long ago for any evidence to remain. Still though, the photos from inside the star are unsettling on their own. The location looks like the perfect setting for the next Exorcist film. 8. Atomic Power the Knowles Atomic Power Laboratory was established after World War II in 1946. The facility is an American research and development base in New York. Most of the work done at Knowles Power Lab is dedicated to supporting U.S. naval nuclear propulsion programs. The company was developed in a contract between General Electric and the U.S. government. The Power Lab is currently government-owned and operated and is responsible for the research, design, construction, operation, and maintenance of the U.S. nuclear-powered warships. This all sounds fine and progressive until you consider that the KAPL is a highly secretive organization. Not much information on the inner workings of the lab are made public, and images from Google Earth show that it has been censored out in a way. It's uncertain whether this is to keep details from the public, cover a conspiracy that may have to do with atomic bombs or nuclear war, or if it's something as simple as covering secrets to a well-managed company so that business and innovation cannot be stolen. Regardless of what you think the reasoning is, these censored images have put Americans and the government of other countries on high alert. An atomic site holding secrets is enough to cause concern for anyone. Number 7. The Doll Island Dolls have always been creepy, and the idea of an island inhabited by dolls is nothing new. This island in Japan, however, did concern several visitors when they first stumbled across it on Google Earth. The Valley of Dolls is a remote village known as Nagaro located in a remote area of Shikoku, Japan. While the small village was once a thriving little neighborhood, most of its inhabitants have since moved to larger cities to pursue better housing and work opportunities. Those that did not move away literally just died within the village and had no one to fill their place in the census. A young artist that once lived in the village made a trip back to her hometown to see how desolate it truly was. The town allegedly doesn't even have a local store. This abandoned valley inspired Ayano to fill the town with her own people. She began crafting life-size dolls ranging in apparent age from toddlers to elderly adults. She has left the dolls in different locations of the town such as schools and homes. The town literally has a higher population of dolls than people. 350 dolls currently reside in Nagaro, and many of them are placed along the roadside so that they can be seen on Street View of Google Maps. Ayano did this to try and encourage visitors that were perhaps intrigued by the lifelike dolls filling the streets of this quaint town. While this story has a softer side, you can imagine the bewilderment of those that were just traveling through Google Maps and came across a town full of dolls living their lives in stop motion. Number 6. The Big Friendly Giant The Atacama Giant, or Giant Cat, or Big Friendly Giant in Chile, is perhaps one of the cutest things that can be found on Google Earth, even if it does still have a huge mystery behind it. The Atacama Giant represents a deity or god for those that inhabited the region from AD 1000 to 1400. The giant figure, measuring about 390 feet tall, was allegedly carved into the earth by well-organized worshippers. In addition to being a huge homage to God, this figure was also a calendar. The points on the head of the figure could help settlers know when the moon would set, what day it was, what part of a crop cycle they were in when it would rain and what seasons were upcoming. This was a huge asset to farmers and gatherers during the time. The mysterious part of this is just how it was made. Much like the pyramids of Egypt and the mass architecture of the Mayans, we question how regular everyday people could create something so massive without technology. It's certainly possible and many methods were likely used, but this cute smiling cat god leaves the mind wondering and wanting to know more about life centuries ago. Number 5. The Nazca Lines Going off the one before of, 
how was this created? The Nazca Lines leads viewers to really question when aircrafts were available for human use. The Nazca Lines are a collection of geoglyphs such as birds, lizards, monkeys, spiders, and more located in the remote Sakura Desert in Peru. They were engraved sometime between 200 BC and 600 AD and were created by the methods of using special tools to arrange dark and light pebbles to show imagery. Due to little and no windiness in the desert, the graffiti has been preserved for centuries on end. The biggest question in the works is why did the Nazca people create these massive artworks? The first speculation is that they were carved for the gods to see, so that they would bless the people of Earth. Other explanations include relations to astrology and farming. An even bigger and harder to answer query is how they were made. These illustrations are so massive that it deemed nearly impossible to accurately create them without the help of an aircraft or structure, but clearly they were carved before the invention of the plane or satellite and there's no clear evidence of tall structures built by the Nazca people. Number 4. Sandy Island this mystery follows the undiscovery of a small island located near Chesterfield Islands. On Google Earth, the small region seems to be blacked out or censored. Despite the island having been on nearly every map throughout history, a whaling ship named Velocity reported the island for the first time in the year 1878, and it landed a spot on maps ever since. Whenever Google Earth users noticed the island was censored, discussion began with speculation of the go to conspiracy concepts and hidden treasures. During this confusion, researchers allegedly went to the location where the island was supposedly located and found nothing. Researchers claim that it was simply a human error from forever ago that just got carried away. Of course, skeptics have other ideas such as the island sinking, being bombed, being hidden with these researchers taking part in the cover up and a more complex idea that claims researchers visited the island and were so horrified by what they saw, they decided to pretend the island never existed. It's certain that the only way to know for yourself whether the island exists is to visit the location. For now, Sandy Island has been removed from maps and satellite images, and those that don't buy the story given are forced to ponder on what could be located in this portion of the sea. Number 3. Bloody Lake Located just outside Souder City, Iraq, this marvelously gruesome lake of blood caught the attention of thousands in 2007. When it was first noticed on a Google Earth map, people produced a variety of speculations. Some claimed that slaughterhouses would dump blood into the lake until it naturally absorbed this red shade. Others claimed it was a work of a higher power or alien being marking Iraq. Another explanation offers that this is a unique method of censorship on Google's behalf, made to cover yet another secret. Nine years later and those of us curious about the blood lake still have no answers. Even stranger is that apparently the lake doesn't look this vibrantly red from a closer view and only appears this way in distant aerial photos. The more logical explanation now is that it's some form of chemical pollution or mineral collection. That doesn't stop the fun, interesting, dark, and sometimes even cruel speculation surrounding this allegedly natural phenomenon. Number 2. Spiral Pattern While many entries on this list have hinted at assistance from alien beings, this is the first that really has an ET vibe to it. The spiral-like pattern is found in the Red Sea government of Egypt. Historians and archaeologists have no explanation for this pattern that relates to the special groups. With the Nazca lines in the Egyptian pyramids, artifacts and grave sites were nearby which helped researchers come to a conclusion. This pattern, however, is allegedly nowhere near other artifacts. More importantly, for certain groups that were known to be in this general area, Something like this was not part of their culture. This image seems to show alternating dips and rises in the sand that have been undisturbed for who knows how long. Since there are really no answers for this one, the most common explanation is that it's the work of an alien life form, leaving a message for humans or possibly making a mark to return later. Any truth behind this really comes from your own beliefs. Even as humans have geological systems in place to help us identify certain locations from space, such as the satellite lines in China used by spy satellites. So if you believe aliens are real and capable of travel to Earth, it would actually make sense to leave some sort of reachable mark behind. Number 1. Nevada The US Air Force Base Area 51, where the most UFO alien and weaponry secrets are believed to be kept, is located in the desert of Nevada. So it's really no surprise that these two mysterious symbols are also located in the same region. 
The Nevada Target is a large, clear road-like path carved into a desolate location of the desert. It's carved out in the shape of a perfect target and the only way to reach it is through an unnamed secure road. The government has come forth and explained this target as a tool for practicing landings for US aircrafts. This doesn't sound too far-fetched considering a lot of testing and practicing for aircrafts is done in this region. However, with the close proximity to Area 51 and the US government's habit of keeping secrets, people are taking that explanation with a grain of salt and keeping their minds open to more. Like perhaps a marking created for when the aliens return, the Nevada Triangle is very similar to the target. It's located in a remote location only accessible via an unnamed road, and the government has brushed it off as a landing practice for aircrafts. Of course, with the way society and conspiracy theorists have associated triangles with the Illuminati, this site can be unsettling. Before you go, I wanted to tell you about the giveaway I'm hosting. But first off, thanks for watching and leave a like so I know you made it to the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe because I upload new videos every week. My name is Chills and I'm thanking you all for your support by giving away three $100 Amazon.com gift cards. It's completely free to enter and you can enter the giveaway by visiting the link at the very bottom of the description. It doesn't matter when you're watching this video because top15s.net slash giveaway will automatically direct you to my most recent giveaway. See the terms and conditions on the linked page for full details. If you want to follow me on social media, my Twitter is at yt underscore chills, and my Instagram is at Dylan is chillin yt with underscores instead of spaces. Feel free to send me a DM if you have any questions or suggestions. See ya.